In this tutorial, we will be looking at two different docs for Ubuntu. The first is Avent Window Manager, and the second one is Docky. The first step is to launch the Ubuntu Software Center. Search for Avent Window Navigator. Then install Avent Window Navigator. You will have to enter your password at this step. Once it's finished installing, close the Ubuntu Software Center and launch Avent Window Navigator from the Applications menu. It will appear at the bottom of the screen. Click the Avent Window Navigator button and click Desk Preferences. On the Preference tab, you can choose the icon size, the orientation, the style, the behavior, the icon effects, whether to expand the panel to the full width or to start the dock automatically. On the Task Manager tab, you can add applications to the eDock by dragging them into the Launchers box. You can add applets to the dock by going to the Applets tab Clicking the applet you'd like to add and clicking the down arrow. Choosing a theme is easy. Select the theme you want and click apply. Go back to the Ubuntu Software Center. We will next look at Docky. Search for Docky in the Ubuntu Software Center. Install Docky, you will have to enter your password at this step. Allow it to install. Once it is finished downloading, close the Ubuntu Software Center. Launch Docky from the Applications menu. Click the anchor symbol to open the Docky configuration. You can select to select, open it when the computer starts, choose a theme, choose a hiding scheme, choose the icon size, the zoom, whether to have it in panel mode, in have a 3D background, or indicate multiple windows. You can add applets called docklets in Docky, the same way you add them to Avent Window Navigator. You can drag the dock around when the dock configuration is open. 